da, 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 da. I'm really glad that they included this in it. I'm I'm just really glad they included this. Just oh my god. They even included the Garolina thing too, which I'm actually really proud of too. <laughs> this kind of sounds a little bit messed up. But uh welcome home! It's Coco Komeda here, and guess what guys? We are here with you guessed it, Petscop. But uh this isn't the real thing, no no no. This is actually a 2D sandbox remake that somebody on Game Jolt actually did. And I thought that was really, really interesting. I thought that was, like, really cool. I have to click on it, I forgot. But yeah, somebody actually decided to remake Petscop. And I'm actually really proud. And um, for those who don't know what Petscop is, Petscop is a, um, it's basically like this game. I can't explain it, like, exactly word for word, but, like, well, there's this channel on YouTube called Petscop, and they have, like, and you guessed it, they have this name called, this game called Petscop, and it's on their PS1, and they got it from somebody, and they got this code, and it seemed like a happy, good game until they entered in the code, and they realized it wasn't exactly what it seemed. <clears throat> the gift plane has closed indefinitely, and all personnel have left. If you are unaware, the gift plane provided homes to over a hundred young pets. Unfortunately, we have failed to remove all of the pets from their homes. Why is the text so slow? <clears throat> 48 pet? 48? I don't remember there being 40. Uh, 48 pets remain here at the time of the writing. We would strongly encourage you to visit our eight homes and find some friends to take with you. <clears throat> Every pet is uniquely valuable. I'm sorry, this is so slow. Um, pers to the person who made this, um, could you speed up the text a little bit? Uniquely yet valuable, you should have no problem finding somebody that you love. The 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 gift plane staff. The sprite's not really that badly made too. I think it looks pretty, really damn close. To, um, I don't think that's supposed to happen. Even care. Do they even have the road, too? Boy, they have the road. I love that. They even included the road. But, like, the one thing that kind of gets at me a little bit is that the fact that you can walk over this part, which I know you're not able to do in the actual game. So... Oh, yeah, that's even care. Okay. Do I click on it? Oh, I hit space, right? <coughs> Then again, this is just a sandbox build so far, and I just want to explore it. Um, I don't think you're supposed to do that. It does look really close to the actual Petscop game, and I'm actually really proud of that. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> is that it? That's creepy. Okay. Come back, little guy. The sprite just looks a little bit off while walking, and that kind of bo bothers me a little bit, too. But, like, still, this is the best that you can do. How do you leave? Do you do this? Is that really it? Uh, I 
honestly thought there'd be more. <sighs> oh, excuse me. I tried to, uh... Yeah. Hang on a sec. Let me just see if I can... Okay, sorry, I just wanted to check that out really quickly, and I guess that's actually it for right now. I'm actually kind of sad. I thought I thought there'd be more, but this is also a really good start. So this didn't leave me completely disappointed. I thought there'd actually be some, like, pets to catch, which sadly there aren't so far. But that doesn't mean that this isn't bad and this isn't terrible, because this is actually really good. And the fact that somebody's actually trying to recreate it made me really happy. Because, like, I thought at first that Pets Cup was, like, this horror game that, like, you could play. <laughs> and I wanted to play it really badly. And the chance to actually, like, get a feel of, like, what it was like for the person who made the original Pets Cup to, like, go through everything... It just, oh my god, it's really cool. Oh. oh, can you do the thing that they- Oh yeah, you can. Thing that I usually never do in video games, because thanks to you, my Nikki, I've just grown so accustomed to just, to just doing this. But then you can actually do this, because I forgot. I like how they included the sound too. I love that too. But um and like the sound of like everything else that just makes me so happy. Like this is a really good start. Um honestly, like tops off to you. This is amazing for a start for um for Pets Club. This is amazing. Like I can I cannot say how good this actually looks and how accurate it pretty much is. I mean, aside from some stuff, it's really damn accurate. And I'm really, I'm really happy about that. Like, I can't wait to see more. Like, I really can't. And it's just, this is, this is really good, and I love this. So, to whoever made this, I'm sorry I completely forgot your name on Game Joel. But, the, who cares? This is, <laughs> this is really good. Keep up the good work. Don't stop. Well, stop whenever you're feeling really tired, but like this is really good. I can't wait to see what this looks like once it's completely done. And I know this is just a sandbox build, and I. But like this is still really good. Just wow. This is this is really good. This is really accurate too. I mean, there are a lot of there are also some stuff that's pretty much off, but so far this is amazing. And, like, one thing I think you should fix first is how slow the text is. Like, it's just really slow. And if it was, like, a little bit more sped up, that way it doesn't take, like, a minute for me to read the entire thing. Like, the little blurb that's there, and then wait another minute for the whole other thing to do that. So, that's only the only thing I really have to have a complaint about. But other than that, this is really good. Oh my god. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. It really means a lot to me. And uh, if you want to see my most recent video besides this one, it's always going to be up here. If you want to see the best video that's going to be for you, my dear friend, it's always going to be right up there. And if you want to subscribe, it's up there too. <laughs> so yeah, you've got three options. Do whatever you want, fam. Do whatever you want. It's all up to you. Thank you for watching. And stay hopeful, though. Stay hopeful, guys. <laughs>